Hey guys, how's it going? I am here today with a couple through the mail successes. I wanted to show you all. Uh, I've got one here in the mail uh, that I just got today and one that I picked up uh, or actually came, mm, I think, Wednesday, a couple days ago. Uh, the first one is this, Ryan Sandberg. Um, awesome rookie card. Uh, I had one and sent it off. He returned it in, I think, exactly a week from the date I shipped it off. So it was super quick, uh, not too far. Uh, to Illinois and back, um, but I got all these addresses off of a website. I can't remember the name of it right now, um, but I wanted to at least show you, if you are interested and you're a Ryan Sandberg fan, uh, here's the address I sent it to. You can see there, Ryan Sandberg, 260 Shoreacre Circle. Um, included $5. I think he charges $5, um, but for a small fee, you can get an awesome Hall of Fame autograph sent back. Um, he didn't send it back in the actual top loader and in the penny sleeve. He just um, dropped the card after he signed it back in the self-addressed self stamped envelope. And he did put the top loader in the penny sleeve back in the envelope, but he didn't actually insert the card into the penny sleeve or the, the top loader. So it was kind of loose on its way back. Um, that's something to just kind of look out for if you do send him something, because I think that's happened with other people. But um, super fast, super quick. And uh, really awesome. I appreciate the the gesture by him because he was very quick. Uh, some other addresses that I have off of the website, and I wish I had written it down for you guys. Goose Gossage, I sent one off to him um, there the day after Labor Day as well. Uh, Alkaline, I don't really have any Alkaline stuff, so I have not sent one to him yet. Wade Boggs, I did not try him yet. I believe the one we're going to look at today is the Hawk, Andre Dawson. Uh, because the return address is from Miami, Florida. And his was $10. Um, on the site, it, it kind of shows you other people's success rate and what address they sent it to and if they had to include a donation or not. And so I wrote those prices down just so I would remember. Uh, for my own reference, I think there's one more on here. I think it's Raleigh Fingers. If I scroll down just a little bit, yeah, there it is. Uh, I haven't tried Raleigh. He's the most expensive of the bunch that I wrote down here. Uh, but I believe we have Andre Dawson. I'm going to keep my address face down. So I will attempt to um, cut this open and see if this is returned from Andre, which would be awesome, another Hall of Famer. All right, here we go. There it is, got the envelope. Uh, nice. And oh man, he even sealed it back, stuck it back in there. Look at that. His signature is one of the best. I could look at his signature. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful signature, Andre. The Hawk. This is 1979 Tops. Um, I purchased this card uh, actually off of Facebook. I was selling 1979 Tops cards, 1980 Tops cards, 81. And. Uh, I purchased this one. You see it kind of moved up out of the sleeve there. It looks like he tried to put it back in there, um, but without the tape, it kind of came off. So anyway, if you guys are interested, Andre Dawson, super quick turnaround to go all the way to Florida and back um, in, what, a week and a half? 12, 10, 12 days is amazing. So I appreciate the gesture from both of these Hall of Fame players, and if any of you guys are looking for through the mail success, these are two guys that are the most consistent, some of the most consistent, and uh, some of the quickest uh, for $5 and for $10. You can't go wrong. So, once again, thanks for watching, and if I get uh, Goose Gossage coming back in the next week or so, I'll probably make a video about him. Have a good day.